everybody in this video i'm going to show you how to get your microsoft graph access token so that you can use to develop your own apps that integrates with the microsoft graph api so let's get started first thing you need to do is you need to have a developer account or if you already are on the microsoft azure platform then you can just use that if you don't have that you can sign up to get a developer account and this is the sign up page you will get 90 day access for free and you can renew it every 90 days this will allow you to familiarize yourself with the Microsoft platform and in particular to be able to integrate your own or develop your own tools with Microsoft Azure and any of the apps that is on the Microsoft platform and once you've jo joined and you're looking at setting up your own app you can go into Microsoft Azure portal and create an app now normally when you create the app you'll be given with a application ID an object ID and a directory tenant ID you're not going to be given an access token which is what you will normally use to gain access to pull information from the Microsoft platform so in order to do that the easiest way I found to get that access token is to use another tool called Microsoft Graph Explorer let me show you that so this is the Microsoft Graph Explorer you just need to log in with with the developer accounts or the accounts you want to use to obtain the access token so this is my developer account and you can basically run different tools to, and run different queries to obtain information from Active Directory or some of the other apps within the Microsoft platform as you can see here the easiest way to get the access token that I found is to run the query and you can there's a list on the left hand side here of sample queries that you can run I'm just gonna pick the me query to get my profile and there you go at the bottom here you'll see the results and the response but then if there's a tab here at the top here which has access token if you click on that and you just can copy this access token and then you can paste that into your code that you're using to create the apps now for those of you that don't know what the graph API does let me give you a brief explanation of what it does and what you can do with it so Microsoft Graph is basically a service that allows developers with a easy and unified API which is an application programming interface to access data from various Microsoft services some of these includes Office 365 Outlook SharePoint OneDrive Azure Active Directory so you can get uh, profile information from your Active Directory and so much more like Microsoft Exchange so if you're a developer this will allow you to build your own apps so that it can integrate within the Microsoft services it's quite powerful and you can use it to automate different tasks as well so if you're looking for an easy way to integrate with your the Microsoft platform and services the Microsoft graph is the perfect solution there are other tools like Microsoft Power Apps or Microsoft Automate and Power BI that you can also use to integrate your apps but I would recommend using Microsoft Graph it's pretty easy and straightforward to use the only thing that I stumbled across was trying to get the access token now if this video helped you in any way please give it a like and subscribe to the channel see you next time